Yo, what's good, YouTube, man? It's Gabe with the Fan TV. Back at you know, this video, like the content of this video, go ahead and smash that like button, like the content of this channel. Go ahead and hit subscribe, man. Uh, another Wednesday, you know what's happening, man? We'll do the injury report. Uh, the injury report, we actually get two days worth of reports. Um, so the Ravens play on Saturday, everything's pushed up a, a, a day. So the injury report that we usually get on Wednesday, we actually got on Tuesday. So we able to get two days of reports now. And uh, we're just gonna hop right into it, man. See what's going on with the Ravens squad, right? So did not practice. You got Calais Campbell, Justin Houston, Marcus Peters, all rest days, veteran days. Nothing unusual about that. Those guys usually don't practice throughout the week. That's been a trend since very early on in the season, um, especially for Calais Campbell and Justin Houston, right? Uh, the Lamar Jackson knee injury. We know what's going on, sprain PCL. Uh, doesn't look like Lamar Jackson is going to play this week. If I just had to guess, he's missed already the first few days of practice. Um, so I would have to guess that we're going to have another game about Lamar Jackson and hopefully we'll see him back week 16 okay uh now limited you got morgan moses uh ronnie stanley jordan stout kevin zeitler that's that's good now morgan moses popped up i guess after you know the game he's been limited both days of practice uh this week so we'll see what's going on with morgan moses ronnie stanley they have him as limited but they're saying it's a rest day so i guess um he was still out there practicing but he just didn't do the full gauntlet of practice so that's good that ronnie stanley's out there he's moving around um, when he's in the, when he's in the lineup, the Ravens are a much better team. It's an obvious statement. It doesn't even need to be said. Uh, Jordan Stout, for the first time they put the actual, like, placement of the injury. Uh, it says right knee injury for Jordan Stout, right? So that's his punt and leg, obviously. Um, or punt and knee, whatever I even want to say it. Uh, so he has a knee injury, but he was limited. Um, I don't know really what that means for Jordan Stout. We'll see. Uh, I would have to assume he still plays. You know, hopefully it's not too bad. We'll, we'll see what happens with Jordan Stout, okay? But Kevin Zeitler is the big one here. Uh, limited. We know he missed the game versus the Steelers. Uh, he pretty much didn't practice at all last week. I think he had maybe one day when he was limited. So for him to come out, start the week off as limited back-to-back, -back, at least he's getting out there. At least he's getting a flow of practicing. So to me, that means that he has a chance of playing. And if we can get Ronnie Stanley and Kevin Zeitler back, uh, well, Ronnie mm -hmm. Stanley's already back, but you know what I mean, back playing at the same time. Uh, that's immense for the Ravens pass game, immense for the for the blocking, uh, for the pass blocking, you know. So um, hopefully Kevin Zeitler can go. He's having really a, a Pro Bowl, All Pro kind of season um, at right guard. So hopefully he can just you know uh, pra uh, practice the uh, rest of this week and then play on Saturday. All right. Um, now for guys who are full participants today, uh, Tyler Huntley, man, big big news. Um, we know that the Ravens, there was talks about, you know, hey, could the Ravens play, or not play, but activate three quarterbacks on Saturday, uh, that being Lamar Jackson, Anthony Brown, and Tyler Huntley. Um, if, you know, certain guys are limited or can't go, we'll see. But Tyler Huntley was limited yesterday, but he was a full participant in practice today. So I would assume that means he's out of concussion protocol. He's past it. You know, he's good. Um, if you watch Marlon Humphrey's IG Live, he said that that hit wasn't about nothing, really. Uh, but the team doctors did the right thing, uh, taking him out the game. Because, you know, players ain't going to want to come out regardless. So you got to protect the player against himself, right? So taking him out the game was the right thing to do. But even after the game, even after the game on the flight, where, you know, talking about Humphrey Archie Law, like I said, he said he was all right. So um, now that's kind of confirmation that we have. He's practiced both days, today in full. So if I had to assume, first the Cleveland Browns this Saturday, Tyler Huntley is going to be your starting quarterback. And Anthony Brown is going to be his backup. All right. Now, one guy also was on here that's full participant in practice was Demarcus Robinson. He did not practice yesterday because of an illness. I guess whatever that is, he's over that. Full participants, full participant, excuse me, in uh, practice today. Um, so you know, hey, it's cold outside. You know, what I mean, you know, guys get guys get sick. It is what it is, right? Um, but that's big news. The Ravens. Sorry about that. Uh, the Ravens uh, have a lot of guys coming back. Tyler Huntley, like, is gonna is good to go. Um, hopefully, Morgan Moses can go. Hopefully, um, Kevin Zeitler can go. That's that's two big things on the offensive line. But Ronnie Stanley's practicing, so that's good. The rest days are the normal: Calais Campbell, uh, Justin Houston, Marcus Peters. Nothing to worry about there. And obviously, star quarterback Lamar Jackson, uh, DMP back to back today, back to back days in practice. So it looks like no Lamar Jackson this week as well. Which is unfortunate, uh, but Tyler Huntley can do a good enough job, I believe, to beat the Browns. Um, obviously, it's not the same as having Lamar Jackson out there, but Tyler Huntley is a capable quarterback. He can do some things that can keep the Ravens um, 
steady and on flow as an offense, right? So that's your Ravens injury report for uh, this Wednesday, man. And uh, yeah, man, the Ravens are looking all right. Not too much um, bad news on here. I guess the only surprise is really Jordan Stout popping up with a knee injury because I'm not quite sure when that happened in the game. But besides that, man, I think the Ravens are in a good spot to have a lot of off the line to come back. They're going to have Tyler Huntley back. Um, of course, it's not Lamar Jackson, whatever, but it's going to be a uh, capable offense on Saturday, right? So that's the good news, man. Um, so yeah, we're going to get out of here. That's your injury report for this Wednesday, man. It's your boy Gabriel, just another fan TV. I'm out.